Hey guys, and welcome back to Them and Us. When we last left off, we found the Plutus key, so it seems like a good idea that we go and use the key. Uh, we've got the shotgun. Yeah, maybe we'll keep hold of the shotgun just for now. You never know, we might need it. Now let's take a walk through here and see if we can't find legions of the undead. Ooh. Talking of legions of the undead, here is one. Come on, friend. There we go. Got a bit of an inspector, oh god, inspector gadget style costume going on here. You know, it's interesting. Whenever I play ahead, I barely ever get hit by zombies. Yeah, as soon as I hit the old record key, let's play as curse. We'll be in full effect. Come on, love. <clears throat> this way. There you go. That's it. Like you mean it. And let's try not to get stuck on too many objects. Now, there is a possibility that there's a zombie behind us as well. Which is... No, we're good. We're good. Uh, it's been a little while since I played this bit. <laughs> so, a little bit foggy. Ooh, her arms come off. Oh, man. The shambling masses of the damned. But at least they're kind of cock-blocking each other. Happy with that. Let's see if we can't take both of these down. With a knout, but a knife. Oh, I know, it's a hard old life, matey. But worry not. It's over now for you. One down. Ah, oh. and his friends had enough as well. So, hopefully, that's this area satisfied. Um, okay. We have some options here. Let's have a little bit of an explore. Oh! Interesting. Restricted area. So something. Oh, something happened down here, didn't it? Well, I mean, he's not producing much juice. Anger magazine. Always got some time for those. And one second. I need to adjust my seat. There we go. Is that really all that's in here? Just a hanger magazine. Got another zombie there. I'm guessing at some point we can drop that down and maybe smash the... Oh, yeah, look. Definitely. Um, I mean, I'm not sure if we're supposed to, like, shoot. I find that hard to believe. Nah, there's got to be something more to this room. All right, whatever. Let's keep looking. At least we've finally been to the bottom of that one now. Another hangar magazine. Locked. Okay, we don't have the key for that one. But we do have the key, or at least the power to... Oh, oh hello. We'll try him with the knife. Hey, sir. Looks like you've had a bit of a mischief. At least you're getting your fluids all over what looks to be a rug. Well, you is interestingly weak. Take that. Look at that little soap dish there. You know, I do like the environments. And I like the fact that we're playing it over the shoulder as well, because you really can get a good look at them. Uh, some more topical ointment, I suppose. Ooh. Another hangar magazine. Really? Wow, we're going to be stacked with that. Ugh. That water's seen better days. I don't know if he was just molding in it. And then decided to get up. But this place is in pretty disrepair. Look, there's like spare tiles there. and There's a lot of detail in these environments. I like it. I like it a lot. 
I think that's one of the few things that I actually really enjoyed about um, oh, that other one that we recently played, Taunted, um, Tortured, oh, I can't remember what that other one was called. The indie one. Right, looks like so we're going to go straight up. Um, that we played, I think it was like last year. Oh, hello. You're a bloater, aren't you? No, you were not, but you were only a two-shot anyway. Yeah, that had really detailed... Tormented Souls, I believe that one was called. Um, that had very nicely detailed environments. So that's the Pluto key. But we can also go in through here. And that's our Pluto key used up. Oh, evening. Oh, that's got to be a bloater. Yep. Huh. So if we kill the bloaters with the crossbow, they don't explode. That's good to know. Hey, buddy. Hey, it's our friendly old grumpy old man. Well, let's see if we can't slice him till he's a chill. Make him so laid back he's on the ground. Oh, buddy. Calm down. Calm down. Let's Try that again, shall we? There you go. Okay. Ooh. Ah, oh, that's fine. Let's leave you. Wait. Oh, we still got the Pluto key. Oh, you son of a bitch. Where can we leave the stuff? Leave that do. That works. Random, eerie, creaking noises. You know what? I think we're just going to leave the shotgun as well. Sure. Because we, we just beam it back. All this liquor reminds me of the of William. He was married to the bottle more than he was married to me. And after what happened to Emily. There must have been a party in here. All these bottles are empty. Hmm. Once some guys, my phone is dinging. Okay, cool. So, what else have we got? So, we've dropped all of our items that were our surplus to requirement. Where does this go? Locked from the other side. Because, of course, it is. Oh. A grand piano. Such a beautifully crafted instrument. There's some blood on some of the keys. Hmm. I wonder if that's a throwback to Silent Hill. I'm gonna say yes. Okay, let's go through the Pluto door and see what presents. Ooh, another handgun magazine. Only seven rounds, that's stingy. That's so stingy. Oh God, I hope they didn't keep people inside of this thing. I mean, if there's human bones in there, then reason to think they probably did. You know. Something feels off here. I don't like it. There has to be a way out of here. Yeah, probably through one of the many doors. We're working on it. Looks like most of these paintings have been taken down. Wonder why. Maybe this place was uh, being renovated. Ooh. This is very fancy. Very fancy. The birth of Zeus, the god of gods. Rhea uh, representing Cronus. Oh. Presenting Cronus as a stone wrapped in cloth. Uh huh. They do reuse quite a lot of the art here, though, I've noticed. 
Right, we can smash you. What do we have? Ah, bowgun bolts, actually. Very nice. It's interesting that bowgun ammo always comes in uh, packs of 15. It never deviates. It's locked. Simple Vesta. Hey, we unlocked it. Ah, that just... Right, got you. No matter. The four descendants look to be guarding an angel. There's a message here. It reads, Because of what you did that night, this place shall be your grave. The guardians cannot protect you forever without their shield of faith. Each guardian represented by a number. There must be a meaning behind this. Yeah, so I'm guessing we need items. Something round. So we can't interact with that one. But we can only interact with that one. Okay. Alright. Cool. Cool. We're learning. We're learning. So we need to find something round. Well, we found something that's half round. Maybe if we can find another thing that's also half round. We can find... We can maybe put the two things together. Yes, crossbow bolts. Yeah, I do like this crossbow. I think I was sleeping on it a little bit too much. You unlocked it. Oh, would you look at that? Very good. Very good. Okay. <clears throat> Yet another coffin. This one is filled with candles. I wonder if they tried to resurrect the dead. I don't like this place. It radiates evil. Well, yes. Uh, lock is jammed. Leads to the balcony. No bueno. There's a circular indentation in the door. I think something can be placed inside it. It's curious. Well, the door... The lock on this door is rusty and brittle. Will we go through anyway? So I'm guessing if we go through here... Uh, it's a one-way trip. <clears throat> yeah, door lock is broken. Oh, evening. Is it just you? If it's just you, I'll fucking have ya. Come on then. Let's be doing this. I mean, you wanted this, buddy. There's no point Ooh, moaning about it now. I suppose at least he did get a nice bite of ass before he succumbs to the great unknown. So this area. Ah, would you look at that? So if we go through here. Yeah, this is just outside. Ooh. Oh, I can hear something. I can hear something. But what? And where? It's like chanting, whispering. Okay. That's curious. Let's go jiggle our junk. Oh, look! Hello. Like a cultist from Resident Evil. What? I did not expect that. All right. Well, I guess maybe I didn't play this far ahead. <laughs> this is all new to me. All right, let's go save all of our items. Jiggle all of our bits and pieces around. Um, what do we want? You know, as much as I'd like to take the pistol just because I like the pistol... Might not be the best idea in the world. Right, let's bring forth our items. 
So we can't go back the way we came. That's okay. More bogon bolts. Sure. Wow, we must have found a hell of a lot more items. Yeah, of course, because we found all the items from the underground as well. Okay. This is promising. Very promising. So we've got more ointment. So many more handgun bullets. Too many handgun bullets, really. If there's such a thing as that. Uh, I don't even think it stacks the ammo, does it? No, so you've got like a hangar magazine there. Hangar magazine there. Yeah, I really don't like this inventory item box. It's just, it's really sloppy. And I know, I'm not a developer, I'm not a programmer, but it's really not fantastic. Right, so we've got tons of ointment. We've got all that ammo. Yeah, we're good. Okay, so let's put the ammo back. Put that back. We've got loads of crossbow ammo, so that's fine. Still got the Plutus. All right. Let's head back on outside. So. Trying to remember, really, where we've got some locked doors that might potentially need the Plutus key. There is one... Ah. No, that was not one that we could go through, I don't think. Okay, let's... Oh, I'd love to kill this guy. I'd like to snipe him. Unfortunately, the boats move much slower than bullets, as you'd sort of imagine. But... At least we can plink away at him. <laughs> oh, there we go. We're actually hitting him. Now, how tough are these guys compared to normal zombies? I wonder. They're not hitting. All right, he can't be hit over there for some reason. Whatever. Let's keep going. Let us keep going and exploring. So this was locked. Simple. There were some other locked rooms around here, wasn't there? Downstairs. There's a big locked room there. Was that what one that we're looking for? Ooh. I can hear bad necks. Hello, buddy. You right there, Chief? You look like you're a little bit confused. Come on, buddy. There you go. Oh, God! <laughs> Jeez Louise. Big Papa Cheese. Whoa. It's got, like, claws. Oh, man. Dude, those things are tough. Wow, they're tough. Got like long, clawy claws. No wonder we weren't having a lot of joy with the other one. All right. But we are back to where we started. These, oh, they hurt. Yeah, we're going to need to be proper weaponized for those guys. Ah, oh, they're everywhere now as well. Right, the good thing is this crossbow is literally rapid fire. Oof. Man, they're hard. Let's see if we can drop him. I mean, he certainly doesn't like it. We are really tearing through this ammo. Yeah, these are literally like almost straight out of Resident Evil 4. It's kind of interesting. Nice, you're gone. I know flattery is supposed to be, you know, 
sign of appreciation or what was it? That's not the word, is it? Um, <clears throat> when you copy something, not plagiarism. It's locked, so that's an earth. All right, so let's try and go downstairs. Hmm. It sounds like uh, my missus is back, so. Uh, one second, guys. Right, okay, so somewhere there has to be a door that we can use this key on. Nope. I wonder if we're going to have some more cultists. We've explored all the way down here, though. Ah, no, there was the door right at the very end. Oh. All right, let's give him everything we've got. So these guys seem to take... Yeah, they take about 10... Between 10 and 15 shots. Right. I was hoping they were going to drop some ammo or something, but no luck, I guess. No. Curious. So that only really potentially leaves one door up. Wait a minute. I thought we unlocked this one. Is it this one right ahead of us, under the stairs? Yeah, we're here. That door should be unlocked, shouldn't it? Ah, I was locked by someone. Sons of bitches. Okay. So, it's all different now. Hmm. Right, what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to go save the game because we are literally in uncharted territory here. And I'm not sure where we're supposed to be going or what we're supposed to be doing. So, we still got him down there. I really would like to get rid of him if we can. And considering how much ammo we've used, I might switch back up to the pistol. Because we've got tons and tons of ammo for the pistol. It's just a shame the pistol doesn't cycle as fast as the crossbow. But anyway, guys, I'm going to save it. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.